so I have a quick disclaimer before you begin. Um, basically, this video is up like three weeks late. I'm very sorry about that. It took a lot of time to edit this video. And um, so if I say anything that like, you're like, wow, that's not really relevant anymore. Um, that's because I filmed this like when I'm still was on winter break. So let's start the video. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So you might be wondering <laughs> why are you wearing a robe? Why are you standing in this weird area? Why is the closet open? Well, you are probably guessing. Well, I don't know if you are. Um, that I'm doing another try and early on in my closet video. Because um, my last one I did, because I did film this like video back in like August, got a lot of views for my channel and I was really impressed. And plus all these other YouTubers are posting the same video. So I was like, like I'm gonna hop on a trend and do it again. Plus my closet does need to clean out because there's a lot of clothes in here that I do not wear. Um, cause I got a lot of new clothing that popped into my closet somehow. And um, I need to get rid of the ones I don't wear, so. Let's get started with the video because this intro is gonna be too long. So this is not sponsored and I'm not trying to brag in any shape or form. All right, let's get started. I'm going to be sitting here for hours filming this video. I'm going to grab the first set of clothing. So I'm just going to grab this whole set here. This is the first set I'm doing. Let's try stuff on. So the first thing is this like plushy hoodie. I recently got this not that long ago. So this is a keep. Next is this like Forever 21 pullover thing. And I love this. I got this for Christmas last year, not 2019, 2018. But I love it, so it's a keep. Okay, guys, so I'm just going to warn you guys ahead of time. Um, throughout this video, my belly button, or just belly in general, does appear quite a bit for the video. Peeps through my shirt. shirt. So um, I'm very sorry about that, but I'm not redoing this whole video because it's too late. All right, guys, so next is this North Face, and unfortunately, this is kind of scratchy. Plus, this is so old, it's a hand-me-down for my sister. Probably had this for a good, like, six, seven years. Um, this, also, I could barely zip it without feeling uncomfortable. So, this is a get rid of. All right, next we have this North Face zip, which I honestly don't wear, like, at all. But my mom will kill me if I get rid of it, so this is going to be a keep. This is the next thing and I think I debated about getting rid of this one last time but I haven't won it since so this is definitely a get rid of okay so next is a sparkly sweater which it's a little tight on the arm since it's a kids section sweater but I still wear it so I guess this time I'm gonna keep and if I do this video again next time and I haven't really worn it then I'll get rid of it and my belly's out so next we have this um don't mind the snorting this um, sweater, which I've worn a lot in the fall, but like ever since fall ended, I haven't really worn it. But I'm going to take it one more time. And if next time I still don't wear it, it's going to be a get rid of, but for now to keep. All right, next we have this basic sweater, um, which I haven't really worn in a really long time, like a few months. But I think it's because I'm scared if it's going to rip again, because I bought and returned a sweater when my mom did three times. This is my third sweater of this because the other two ripped. Right when I got them. So. That's probably why I'm not wearing it. But we're going to keep this. So next we have this sweater. Which I had since freshman year. And it's kind of getting in bad shape. So I think I'm finally going to say goodbye to this sweater. Since I got the other one. So. Good memory sweater. Kind of has bad memories in this too. Okay so next is this cardigan. Which I wear quite a bit. It's a little uncomfortable. But I do wear it a lot. Um, if like, I need a cardigan for a shirt. So I'm going to keep this. So next we have this cardigan, which um, is more of a lightweight cardigan, but I really don't like it that much anymore. So this one's a get rid of. All right, not going to try this one on because I'm way too lazy, but I already know this is a get rid of because I had a bad memory in this. Plus it's a little too small because I like to wear it buttoned up, but it's still too small for that. So this. Goodbye. So next we have this sweater from Target, which I honestly really love. It is a little itchy, but it is worth it because it's really cute. So we're going to keep this. All right, guys. So the sweater I'm wearing is the same as these two, but just in different colors. I'm keeping all three of them. Do I need to keep all three of them? No. But I love this sweater so much that I am going to keep all three of them. So, all right. So I got this sweater for Christmas. So obviously it's a keep. Okay. So next is this button-up cardigan, which I just got not that long ago and like, 
either December or November. So this is a keep. This sweater is a keep. Um, haven't worn it in a few weeks, but I think I'll wear it again pretty soon. So next is the sweater, um, which fun fact, I don't like sweaters that have holes in them because when I'm in school, the cold air breathes through the, the holes and then I get cold. And I really don't like the sweater really. So this is a get rid of. So next we have this sweater, which I still love. And even though I got it like last season, I still love it. So we're gonna keep. All right, I'm debating because I really like the sweater, but it does have some bad memories attached to it. But I think I'm still gonna keep it because it's still a good sweater. It's just, there's a bad memory attached to it, so. Okay, next is this blue sweater and I recently got it, not that long ago. So this is a keep. Fun fact, this is the first time I am trying on this sweater like ever because I haven't worn it yet. My mom handed it down to me. I don't like it, um, but I thought I saw a teacher wear the same one. So if, if I went to school, that'd be kind of embarrassing. embarrassing. I'm not 100% sure if I did. I don't remember, but I think I might have, so. But it's still a keep. So next is this shirt, which I don't like it down. So usually I like tie it or something, but this is a keep. So next is this purple sweater, which is my like favorite sweater last season. Like I wore it out so much, but I think I'm going to keep it for one more season because I love it so much. But the condition is not good, but we are going to keep it for one more season. So next is this sweater. The only problem is, is how this neck is like laid out. It's not the most comfortable. It looks cute, but I think I'm going to keep it just because I like it. Next we have this shirt, which I really like. Um, this was, I has memories, because this is when I got my second ear piercing, which was just over a year ago. Um, but I really like it, it's really comfortable, so I, we're gonna keep. Next we have this sweatshirt, which also has horrible memories attached to it, but we're gonna keep it because it is comfortable. Next is this red sweatshirt, which I honestly don't like that much, and it's really itchy, so actually I think we're gonna get rid of this one, we're gonna let it go. All right, next we have this sweatshirt, which I don't like the sleeves. I don't like how they're small, but I think that's how they're meant to be. But we're going to get rid of this one because I hate the sleeves. So, yeah. Next we have the gray sweatshirt. I think I'm going to keep this one because it's not as uncomfortable as the red one. Plus, it's a basic color, so we're going to keep. All right, guys, next I have this basic red shirt that I got for homecoming for junior year because our color is red. But I'm going to get rid of this one because junior year for the first off, it's a very stressful school year, and I just, this just brings the memories. And second of all, it's not my style. And it's a little dirty. So we're going to get rid of it. So next we have this striped tee. Um, well, not tee, but like kind of like sweater. Um, I'm debating because I don't wear it like at all. But it is so comfortable now that I have it on. Um, but I think I'm going to keep this one. Because I think this one's also the bigger size. So it fits better. I think the next one, which is this one, which I'm still going to try on to see. Because this is, yeah, this is an extra small. I don't think it'll fit my body but this one's probably gonna be keep all right here's the extra small which actually is pretty much just as comfortable so we're gonna keep this one too all right guys next we have this flannel which i just got to replace the massimo one well i got it like a few months back but it was to replace the massimo one so we're gonna keep this not even gonna try this one on because it is massimo this is uh get rid of because it's massimo Next, we got this flannel, which I would wear, except for the fact that my mom pretty much has the same one, and she wears it almost every day, and I just don't want to wear it on the same day as her. I'm going to keep it because I'm going to try to figure out if I can wear it on a day she's not going to wear it, but... We're going to keep. All right, so I think I'm going to say goodbye to this one because this is an extra small, and it is way too tight on me, like... Yeah, so this is a get rid of. All right, so this is also an Old Navy sweater, like... Not sweater. Flannel, like the one that was too small, but this is in a size medium. And it fits much better, so this is a keep. Next, we have this shirt, which I think, I don't think it flatters me, like, at all. So, I'm going to get rid of this one. So, next, we have this shirt, which gives me grandma vibes, but I actually kind of like it. It's a little weird. So, we're going to keep this one. So, next, we have this shirt, which I really like. And also, I usually pull the tank top up a little bit. But it is a little bit tight, but it's not horribly tight. So, I think I'm going to keep this one. Okay, this shirt's way too complicated to, like, put on, but it's this. It is a little bit small on me, but I do wear it still, so I think I'm going to keep it one more time, and then if I don't like it after, then I'll get rid of it. So this is the next shirt, which actually is one of my all-time favorite shirts, like, I've ever owned, so we're going to keep this one. Haven't worn a shirt in forever because my teacher has the same one, and I just haven't worn it since because it kind of scarred me, but... <laughs> 
We're gonna keep it because it's comfortable. So I just went outside of school. Okay, this shirt I like a lot. Um, so I guess I'm gonna keep it. I thought I wasn't gonna keep it before I put it on, but now that I have it on, if I, yeah, I think I'm gonna keep it. So next we have this shirt, which I like very much. It's a little too cropped for my liking, but we'll wait till the summer clean out and I'm gonna keep it until then. So I'm not gonna try this one on because it's really complicated to get on, but you know when you have clothes and you like wear them for like a week and then you just don't like them anymore? This is what exactly what happened to this. I'm gonna get rid of this. Also, I'm not gonna try this one either because it's all in a hanger like this and I just don't wanna too, too lazy. lazy. But I won this one a lot last season and I really like it. So we're gonna keep this one. Okay, I really like this shirt. It's a little uncomfortable with the off the shoulder, but I like it. And like, I think I'll wear it again in the summer, maybe for a bralette or something. So we're gonna keep this. We have a kimono, which I'm not gonna try on because um, I debated about getting rid of this last time, but I'm gonna try to wear it this summer, even though it will be like three years old. I wore this when we were going on a cruise back in 2017. So it is a little outdated, but it's still cute in my opinion. So we're gonna keep it. So next we have this shirt, which um, was the best thing ever for sunburns because I had some really bad sunburns over the summer. When with the strap, it was just made it so comfortable. So yeah, we're gonna keep this one because it is like a sunburn saver. So next we have this shirt, which I am gonna keep because it is a good basic for summer. I think I am gonna keep it because um, for 4th of July, but I do if I do find something else, then maybe I'll get rid of it. Unfortunately, I'm getting really lazy to film, but these two I keep because I know that I like these, so these two I keep for sure. This shirt is good for my school colors within the last five months I'm in school. And maybe when I'm alumni and go to football games, I guess it'll be good. I guess we're gonna keep it. All right, so I'm gonna explain why I'm getting rid of this shirt. Um, it is because I had this for like years. You see my sister's, now it's mine, and I had it for years. And I don't know, it has some stains on it. We're just gonna get rid of it. All right, so next is this basic tank top. I'm not gonna try on because I just got it and I know I'm gonna keep it because it's a basic tank top. So I'm gonna keep this one. So next I have this tank top, which I'm debating on getting rid of or not because it is so old but i think i'm gonna keep it because it's a basic black striped black and white striped tank top which i think i'm gonna keep it until i replace it with another one so next we have this shirt which these kind of sleeves are making me kind of question myself because they're kind of like, like muscle man. i don't know the sleeves make me feel a little i don't know <laughs> but i think i'm gonna keep it because it's comfortable and the next year i already know what i'm gonna do this has horrible memories attached to it plus it is ripping because my boobies are too big for this shirt so we are getting rid of this one because it's falling apart plus it had a bad memories okay this is probably tight because i have a bra and a tank top underneath but these shirts are the same shirt basically just different color and different print so we're gonna keep both of these so next we have this shirt which i like but the problem is it just looks stupid with this but i think i am gonna keep this one and then maybe later on decide on if I like wear it in the summer or not. So we have this green shirt, which I basically have the same shirt, but in cotton. This one is going bye bye. Okay guys, so we have this wrapper. Um, let's just say this wrapper is the hardest thing to get on, but once it's on, it fits like a glove. And I'm not gonna button this because it's just too much work, but you do, it looks like that. This is a keep. So next we have this romper. So my tank tops are bunched up in here, so don't mind. Guess we're gonna keep this one this dress and we're gonna keep this one but once again i'm too lazy this one's a, from a different brand it's from old navy but it's very similar so i'm gonna keep this one too this might be a hawaii dress i might wear this one in hawaii but we're gonna keep both all right i think this dress looks good so we're gonna keep it so i'm too lazy to try this on but i already know that this one is going to be way too small for me so we're gonna get rid of this one so this one I know is gonna fit, um, so I think I'm gonna keep this one. All right, so this is like a t-shirt dress. We're gonna keep this one. All right, guys, so that is cleaning out my closet um, my, for shirts and dresses and wrappers and all that. I have a huge mess I need to clean up, and then tomorrow we're going to resume with pants. All right, guys, so um, I decided not to add in the pants section to this video only because I basically gave up 
filming the pants section and I only tried on about half of them plus like the angle is odd and this video will be way too long if I add in the pants section. So basically what I did was I cleaned out my pants. I kept most of my pants um, except for the pants that were like kid size 14, like 14 plus. I got rid of those ones and that's basically it. I basically kept everything else. So um, yeah. Alright guys, I'm back. I'm very sorry about that, but I did not add a pants section also because um, it would take me another week to edit and I want this video to be up because I'm starting for more videos and I don't want them to be more behind, you know what I mean? So I decided to, to cut out the pants section. I hope you guys are okay with that. I'm very sorry. Alright guys, so I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm sorry for the um, weird, long, awkward video. Um, I've been so busy with school that I've been literally like... This video is not going to be perfect because I've just been so stressed of school. So I hope you guys are okay with that. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more. My description has all the information you might need. And I'll see you guys for my next video. Bye.